Hey, what's going on, y'all? Uh, so I wanted to kind of um, show you my oil cooler setup. So uh, I got lucky, was able to pick up um, you know this 34 row D1 uh, oil cooler setup with you know pretty much all the options on the you know protective uh, sleeve and um, thermostatic uh, sandwich plate. Um, was it? I went ahead and bought a uh, Rebel uh, oil pressure gauge. And so what's uh, common that a lot of people do uh, to kind of add this aftermarket pressure gauge is uh, one, um, look on the block, my oil pressure sensor is actually broken on this block, but the one on the left right there, that's the OEM oil pressure sensor uh, you can get a adapter um, and the stock one uh, thread is like a 1/8 uh, BS B, uh, PT um, but most aftermarket use a 1/8 uh, NPT um, and the adapter pretty much has uh, a, a male end uh, to go that goes into the block a female end to put your OEM one on and then like on the side has the uh, NPT threading on it to put your aftermarket uh, that's one option and then of course the uh, second option would be you know to get like a Mishimoto or glow shift um, sandwich plate that already has the um, 1 8 uh, NPT uh, ports on there uh, for me, I decided that I didn't want to stack sandwich plates that some people actually do. Um, and I didn't want to get an adapter um, to kind of extend off. Nothing wrong with those options. Uh, I actually went ahead and did something a little different. Uh, got a Race Flux um, T uh, fitting and pretty much, uh, you know, uh, this in itself is oh, sorry, right here is the fitting. It's got the port for um, you know a 1/8 NPT for it. Uh, it's a dash uh, 10AN that goes with the Z1. Uh, so this is sort of how I plan to route it. Um, despite it being kind of like standoff uh, relative to the other side. Um, I should have some room to be able to make it work, but we'll see. Um, I've, I haven't seen anyone run this particular method, but I feel like uh, this is sort of where I kind of want to go with. But yeah, just kind of giving you know y'all some options because you know uh, option one, option two are the most popular, and this one I really haven't seen too much. Um, so yeah, and that's the uh, race flux. You know, dash in, a in. I got it for about like, you know, 18 bucks shipped. Uh, that's the website I got it off of. All right, thanks.